Number 37. A walrus transfers energy by conduction through its blubber at a rate of 150 watts when immersed in a negative 1 degree Celsius water. The walrus internal core temperature is 37 degrees Celsius and it has a surface area of 2 meters squared. What is the average thickness of its blubber, uh, which has the conductivity of fatty tissues without blood? All right, so this is the conductivity of fatty tissues without blood right from your table. They're talking about conduction. As soon as they talk about conduction, you know it's this particular formula up here. And basically, this one is just another plug and play kind of deal, right? Uh, remember, they're telling us 150 watts. Watts is a power unit. Power is known as energy per time. In this case, with the heat chapter, energy is represented as Q per T. So if you notice, Q per T, there it is. So that's what a watt is. So you can plug in power for Q over T. That's equal to the uh, thermal conductivity constant multiplied by the surface area over which the object is conducting heat through. Multiply, uh, multiplied them by the temperature difference between the two surfaces. Divided them by the thickness of that particular uh, object that we're talking about. So uh, basically we're after D, right? So we just have to do a simple cross multiplication. So bring the D out of the denominator, up into the numerator, bring the P out of the numerator basically and down into the denominator. And lo and behold, here is the formula. So now all we have to do is just plug in, right? Make sure you get the right units. K, as I mentioned, is looked up in the table. The area they mentioned was two square meters. The temperature differential, just take into, you know, just take 37, doesn't matter which one you choose. The difference is the same. The magnitude will be the same. Uh, it'll be the sign that changes, but the sign just represents if heat's being lost or gained. But you can just understand if heat's being lost or gained by looking at the hotter object and then the cooler object. Heat always goes from hot to cold, not the other way around. All right, and then multiply, divided by then the uh, power here. So that's it. I mean, this is so, so simple, right? So simple. So 0 0.2 times 2 multiplied then by essentially 38 divided then by 150. And we have a thickness here in terms of meters of 0.101, and that's in meters, or basically 10 centimeters, okay? And that takes care of that. Yeah, I don't know what units you need it in, but you can convert it to whatever units you need now. So guys, thanks for tuning in. Hopefully this helps. Please remember to help us out and subscribe, and we'll see you next time.